Alrighty, back at it with Duelist Kingdom action. And in this one, we're going to have what would have been yesterday's match if Mokuba wasn't playing against Jaden. We've got Bones going up against Mokuba. And you would think it should be Bones, but it should be pretty even because both Duelist's deck, their decks aren't all that powerful. So we should get an even match in terms of monsters. All right. I missed who was first. Well, from Bones' perspective, to begin with, there's Armored Zombie and Clown Zombie, so some of his anime monsters. And Bonesy, no, sorry, Mokuba is up first. Face down spell or trap and a face down defense. In return, there's Zanki. And Bones goes for the Armored Zombie. So he does have a stop defense in his hand as well. So Clown Zombie, also an anime monster. There is a Dark Plant, a weak throw away from Bones. There's also Magical Ghost and Wood Remains. So nothing super powerful in Bones' hand, but enough to claim an early advantage. What does Bones have in response? He goes with a face down defense again and to his end phase. Bones, oh, Dark Hole, good card. If he gets in trouble, he's got a he's got a field sweeper. All right, armored zombie in for an attack, and that is drooling lizard that is destroyed. So bones off to a promising start if you're on his side. All right, turn change back to Mokuba. And, ooh, Ancient Lizard Warrior. Won't be enough to get over Armored Zombie. Will be enough to get over that Clown Zombie, though. Alright, 50 life points comes off of Bones. So, he's still got Magical Ghost. There's Duku Roizu, the Grim Reaper. Still got Wood Remains as well. There is Magical Ghost. And now Armored Zombie in for the attack. 100 points off of Mokuba, plus another 1300. So he's going to be down to, what's that, 5250. And Bones starting to take advantage here. Mokuba will need something, and he'll need something pretty quick. Otherwise, Bones will begin to take this one. There's Red Medicine. 500 life point increase, and another face down defense from Mokuba. There's Crawling Dragon. And interesting still, Tribute's Magical Ghost. Could have gone with Wood Remains, but now two good monsters on the field. Crawling Dragon and Armored Zombie as Living Vase is destroyed. And 1,600 points again off of Mokuba's total. So he's struggling here. He's It's his turn though. Three cards in hand. That face down card hasn't been any use to him as of yet. And it's another face down defense. So Mokuba not able to do much at the moment. There's, oh, there's card destruction. So Bones sets it down. Oh, and he's played stop defense, so he's going to flip that that defensive card up. And oh, there we go. Bones had a magic. Uh, sorry, Mokuba. Mokuba had a magic jammer sitting in wait, and he has discarded Trent or Trent, I think it might be might be called. But stop defense has been used, and Bones activates card destruction. So he'll draw three more cards, and Dark World Thorns was the other card. There's Snake Hair. It's another 1500, another another decent card for Bones, and it's not looking good for Mokuba. He's there's Beaked Snake. So 3100 coming off of Mokuba's total here. Bones has barely been touched. Only a 50 point loss for him. Alright, turn change, back to Mokuba, last turn, and if, if he has anything at all, there's Forest. May have been handy earlier, but 
Oh, no monsters to play. So that's going to do it for the first duel. The first leg in this best of three, as we see Ghoul with an appetite come to the field, and Bones is going to get a comfortable win first up here. Would have liked it to have been more competitive, but that's the way, that's the way it happened. All right, match number two. Let's set him back up. All right, as this one sets up, who's in, who's in Battle City today? I'm not sure. I will have to check at the end. We will have another Jaden match as well tonight. Uh, Jaden's opponent will be... He had Mokuba last time, so it should be... It will be Bakora. Jaden will play Bakora later on after this match. All right. Green Phantom King is the standout card here at 1600 defense. And the other three, 1100, 800, and 800. Again, not much in terms of attacking forces here for Mokuba. He does have negate attack on the field. Alright, it's a face down from Bones and Ghoul with an Appetite. The card that finished last year is the one that starts on this one. Now, it is a stalemate, 1600, 1600. And into main phase number two. And it is Laughing Flower. And. Mokuba decides to set down Maneater. So he does have a few good tribute monsters in his deck. Emperor of the Land and Sea, Queen of Autumn Leaves are the standouts. But tough if you Mokuba to get a win. There's, oh, there's stop defense again. That 1600 is now turned into 500 attack. Mokuba does have negate attack. Does have negate attack, so he can... Can at least block for this turn. There's Dragon Zombie. Alright, and there we see Negate Attack. That will also end the battle phase. So, Bones will pass the turn back to Mokuba. And Green Phantom King back to defense and now Laughing Flower in defense as well. So, lucky for Mokuba, he does have the 1600 defense, but how long will that last for? Alright, Bones plays the Dark Assailant. So, starting to build up his forces here. And, oh, Tribute to the Doomed. Great card and very suitable for Bones as well. As we see, Zanki is thrown... And the Green Phantom King has been destroyed. Those two face downs are not strong. And oh, Call of the Haunted. Okay, Zanki is coming back here. And another 1500 on the field for Bones. Great play using the effect of Call of the Haunted. We'll get him another attacker. And there is Maneater that's just been destroyed. Well, Bones not taking any chances. Going. For the stronger monsters to sweep the field. Now 15 and 12 is 2,700. That's going to come out of Mokuba. He's going to be down to 5,300. And not looking good. He could lose on the next turn, actually. He, he's staring down a lot of attack force. And it's a polymerization. That is no good. Mokuba has not pulled the cards in this one. The heart of the cards is not with him. Not on his side in this match. As down goes Living Vase. So if Bones has drawn a strong enough monster, this could be it. And Armoured Zombie to complement the Zanki. And oh, he goes with Dark Assailant and he wins it as well. So 16 and 16 is 32. Plus 15 is 47. 50, so it'll be 6,200 all up, and Mokuba is done. He cannot survive these attacks. Well, incredible showing from Bones. He's come out, and he has absolutely decimated Mokuba. Bones only lost 50 life points the whole, the whole of the two duels. Convincing win, and a very quick one as well.
but that is as it played Mokaba no match for Bones that is one of Bones' most dominant performance of the season he gains himself a season point and let's check out so in Duelist Kingdom the next one will be Joey going up against Weevil as Bones picks up a season point where is Bonesy in the standings he's still 15th he's one above Mokaba it was a battle of 15th and 16th I didn't actually notice that earlier all right, over in Battle City, uh, I think it might be Shizu and might be a Shizu and Seeker actually, um, and it is Seeker versus a Shizu. So ugh, another Seeker match, but we'll see how he goes. Anyway, thanks everyone for tuning in. Thanks for leaving the comments as well. I appreciate the support wherever you are in the world. Stay safe. Take care. Farewell.